I'm coming up on three years on YouTube and it's been sort of a mixed experience. It isn't what I thought it would be at all, but um, it's been interesting in some ways and bruising <laughs> in some ways. Um, but I remember three years ago when I started my YouTube channel, I did it because I wanted to discuss consciousness. I've been studying Wittgenstein, basically, the later Wittgenstein. And some people don't study Vic, late Wittgenstein, they study early Wittgenstein, but he actually talked a lot about consciousness um, and subjective consciousness. Um, especially in philosophical investigations. So I had just come from reading that. And I had been in analytic philosophy, but I was really interested in what Wittgenstein said about subjective experience. So I'd studied, uh, I'd read a lot, I'd tried a lot to figure it out for myself, and I was kind of in despair that I would ever learn enough to know what subjective consciousness was, and I still don't know. I was amazed recently to find this little video. It's I'm just going to play the audio. It's Richard Dawkins. He's asked what is the most important question by um, Charlie Rose, and I'm just going to play the audio of it because his answers to the question, which are questions, by the way, they're exactly what I came to YouTube for um, to discuss this and to to think aloud about this and to listen, mostly listen, to other people thinking aloud about the same thing. There used to be a lot of videos about this particular topic, but there aren't very many anymore. It can be frustrating thinking about what subjective consciousness is, and I understand that, but I still that's the reason I came to begin with and in spite of some diversions those are the questions that are still plaguing my mind so I'm just gonna let Dawkins um, speak and ask the questions and then um, I'm gonna be discussing this from now on I think on my channel uh, as well as probably the history of and philosophy of science which I was doing to begin with I, in other words, I just kind of want to return to my roots and talk about things that I find fascinating and interesting. And when I see drama, um, I just kind of want to give it a wide berth and talk about things that excite me. So this is one of them. So here is Dawkins talking about what he considers the most philo important philosophical question. One last question. What is the one question you most want to see answered? How does subjective consciousness work? How does it evolve? And what's going on? When I have my own private feelings and you have your own private feelings, what happens when I see something red? What, what is it that makes the redness? What is it that makes the smell of onions? What is it that gives the, 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 the subjective sensation that I know I have and I suspect you have, but I can never know what's going on inside your head? The questions Dawkins just asked are the same questions that I obsess about, so they'll be in the low bar, and I'm hoping that I'll get some responses and some interesting and engaging discussion about this. Whatever. You guys take care. Bye.